Welcome back. Well, we can't help but hear about more alleged sexual encounters with Tiger Woods. Jordy Lippi, a reporter for Life and Style Weekly, is here with us this morning. Jordy, I, I, it just never ends. It doesn't end, does it? So what is your magazine reporting now? Well, you know, so far we have um, ten mistresses that are confirmed. Seven are identified. Three are not. But, of course, as of today, there's other reports that, you know, uh, there's an 11th, possibly a 12th mistress coming out, too. So the numbers just keep growing. And what about, you may have some audio version of possible sex with Tiger Woods? Right. Um, Ian Halpern, who's an investigative journalist, he told Life and Style exclusively that he was approached two years ago with audio of um, Tiger Woods having phone sex. He was never able to authenticate it, but he said it sounded very much like him, and it just proves that there was rumors as of you know, two years ago that he was doing. Uh, does Life and Style uh, magazine touch on the fact that uh, a lot of this sex was perhaps unprotected? Absolutely. Uh, Jamie Grubbs has come out and said that, and also Mindy Lawton, who's another alleged mistress, has come out and said the exact same thing. And it just brings up the questions, you know, um, he has a wife at home. He could be bringing home all types of diseases, and there's also the possibility, could there be a child out there that he doesn't know about? Mm. We also have audio tape from uh, a porn star. Her name is Holly Sampson. She has also been identified as Tiger's uh, mistress. Let's listen to what Holly has to say. Tiger Woods, um, yeah, that was How amazing. did that happen? Well, a friend of mine, Brent Bolthouse, he runs a lot of... Uh, okay, obviously, you know Brent Bolthouse. Bolthouse. Yes, okay, of course so I do. He, he used to be a friend of mine, and he was good friends with one of uh, Tiger Woods' assistants. So me and my girlfriends, we did a bachelor party for Tiger, and, uh, and it was amazing. And then he picked me to go in the room and yeah. have some, you know, whatever. And I some whatever, Jordy. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about that? Well, you know, it came out um, a, a while ago, and people just didn't believe her. And I think that's what happened. Is that's what's been happening with a lot of these women? Is people didn't believe it because he has that squeaky clean image, and everyone's like, "Oh, that can't be true." So it just proves that you know maybe all these women have been around for a long time. I'm sure Life and Style is like a magnet, and you're getting a lot of people who were calling and saying they had some kind of relationship with with Tiger. Do you think there are a lot more that we don't know about? I think there could be a lot more. I think uh, some people are going to be coming out now maybe trying to hope to you know get a dollar off some of these magazines or other media outlets but I think there's still more to come what about nude photos what's life and style saying about nude photos with Tiger Woods right Playgirl um, confirmed to life and style exclusively that they were approached with nude photos of Tiger Woods which again they are trying to authenticate but um, you know we'll have to wait and see and we actually spoke to Stephen Hirsch who is the founder of vivid entertainment he said if there was a sex tape with Tiger Woods it would be worth between five and ten million dollars Okay, so that's what you're focusing on in Life and Style this week. Yes. On newsstands right now. Absolutely. Jordi Lippi, thank you so much thank for you. being here. And our coverage of the Tiger Woods scandal continues on our website, myfoxny.com. Greg, over to you.